Or it is also going to the like to share how to integrate secant to the power of 5x with respect to x. We know that if let's say we integrate secant squared x, we will obtain tangent x. So we are going to rewrite the integral in terms of secant cube x times secant squared x dx and we apply integration by plus. So we can let u be equal to secant cube x and integrate dv equal to integrate secant squared x dx which means that v is equal to tangent x. Now recall that the derivative of secant to the power of nx is equal to n times of tangent x secant to the power of nx which means that if we have q then du dx is equivalent to 3 times of tangent x secant qx so which means that du is equal to 3 times tangent x secant qx times dx now we apply integration by parts. So we have secant to the power of 5x dx is equal to u times v minus integrate v times du. So tangent times tangent, we have tangent squared. 3 times, so 3. Secant cube x dx. Recall that. 1 plus tangent squared x is equal to secant squared x, which means that tangent squared is equal to secant squared x minus 1. And now we copy the remaining part. So we have secant cube x tangent x minus 3 is constant, so we can take out times secant cube x dx. And we expand this part, we should obtain minus 3 times secant square secant cube. So secant to the power of 5x dx minus minus we have plus 3 integrate secant cube x dx. Since as we can see, this is exactly the same as this, which means that we can group them together and apply reduction. So minus 3 move over to the left become plus 3. So this is 1 plus 3, we obtain 4. And we copy the remaining part. So we have integrate secant to the power of 5x dx is equal to secant 3x tangent x plus 3 times of integrate secant cube x dx and now we divide the whole equation by 4 so 4 over 4 become 1 which means that we have integrate secant to the power of 5x dx is equal to 1 over 4 secant to the power of 3x times tangent x plus 3 over 4 times recall that we already done for this in the previous video which is equivalent to 1 over 2 times secant x tangent x plus ln of tangent x plus secant x and we plus the constant c so which means that we have 1 over 4 secant cube x tangent x plus 3 over 4 times 2 is 8 and we have secant x tangent x plus ln of tangent x plus secant x plus constant c and hence we're done okay that's all for this video thanks for watching hope you like this see you